Hello everyone, welcome back to Math Mode. In this video, I'm going to show you how to solve this interesting integral. We have integral nominator and denominator, and mostly in most cases, integral like that, if we have nominator and denominator, is the hard one because it's really hard to integrate it. But in our case, I'm going to show you how to solve this integral really fast and give them a really good trick. First of all, take a look. If we have, for example, 7 plus 5 in our nominator dividing by, for example, 4. So if we have a sum in our nominator and if we have a constant in our denominator, so if we add two numbers, 7 fourths plus 5 fourths, take a look. This is the same as right here. This is the same and this is the same. If we divide in both sides by 4, we will have this case and if we Go in reverse way, we will have this case. So this this logic works. And take a look. If I write this expression, so x plus 1, we can write this x plus 1 dividing by x, we can write as x dividing by x plus 1 over x. So using this logic, this is correct. And take a look. This is a really good moment because right here we will have 1. So 1 plus 1 over x. This is the same as right here. So I hope you understand this logic. If we just separate this this fraction into in this using two elements, and take a look, it's really good case to integrate this element because this is the same as right here, and this is the same as right here, and moreover, this is the same in our integral. So we need to integrate one plus one over x one over x dx. And take a look, we have a sum, so we need to integrate firstly this element plus integral of this element. And we need we need to know this is the table case. Integral of 1 over x equal to natural log x. So we'll have our final answer that this integral of x plus 1 dividing by x dx equal to integral of 1 plus 1 over x. Using this logic, we simplify this. And our final answer will be x plus natural log absolute value x and plus a constant. So really good, really good trick. Really good trick how to simplify this. I hope you understand this trick. If you don't, write a question in a comment. I try to answer on every question and see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.